Welcome to Adventures in, Fla in Parenting again and Flaherty again. Yeah, hi, I'm Julie Flaherty, and I'm out at the Colt Complex today, and I am watching Matt Matt, our 18-year-old son, play rugby, and I posted earlier today that we were going to watch rugby, and I have no idea how to play the game. So if you have any ideas, or could explain it to me in layman's terms, and what I mean by layman's terms is like you would explain it to a kindergartner. I would very much appreciate it. But as I said, if you see behind me, I'm at the Colt Complex today. We are at the training facility, I believe it is, or the practice facility, or, yeah, I don't know much about football. Go Colt! Yay! <laughs> yeah, it's a ball, right? And here's what I know about rugby. Here's what I've learned in my time here. That not a lot of people watch rugby, but there's a big crowd here today. We'll show you the crowd in a minute. Number one. Number two, they whistle a lot. Um, number three, they play with the ball, but it's similar to a football, but it's not called a football, so I don't know what it's called. Um, and then they don't have touchdowns, they have tries. Isn't that sweet? They try. And they have to touch the ball at the end, like a touchdown, but it's not a touchdown, it's a try. And then at some point during the game, they have to lift people up like in a fancy ballet move, but it's not called a fancy ballet move, it's called something else. And they scrum things. I don't know what they're scrumming, but they're not cleaning anything. It looks like a man hug, and they're kicking the crap out of each other. Don't understand that either. So there's lots of things that don't understand about this game, but it looks really cool. I'll never play it because they don't wear helmets or shoulder pads or anything, so I would die if I played. But anyway, I digress. We're at the Colts Complex playing rugby. Well, we are. We're watching rugby. So there you go. Uh, the kids are sort of having fun, not really, but they think they're having fun. Um, I'm going to tour you around the complex really quickly. It's a big complex, but I'm not going to walk it because that would be exercise. So um, over here is the field, and we're going to pan out towards the field so you can see the players are actually, Noblesville is out there, and I'm not sure who the other people are, but it doesn't really matter because it's not Noblesville. So, yeah, and they're way out there. They run the whole field like a football field, but it's not football. Um, so at the end of this beautiful complex that we've been allowed to come in is um, those are all the uh, AFC championship dates and the flags and the people walking by and then we've got these lovely football goals which are ginormous they don't seem that big on TV and we can pay back Okay, so here's what I've learned today. I've learned that rugby is not like football at all. It's more like street ball and hockey without the sticks. I will continue to learn about the game, but once again, if you have any information about how to play this game and you could explain it to me in a kindergartner's way, I would appreciate it. I'll talk to everybody later. Bye.